Hello, I hope this video finds you well. Today is day 21 in my daily routine of recording a coding bat solution while schools are closed. Um, I usually do one a night, but actually I'm going to work through strings one and list one together. And the reason why is because I really want to highlight the similarities between strings and lists and how you manage them, and also the relatively quick, quick problems, because there are no loops in these. All right, so we're going to look at string one, hello name, and the Python solution. Given a string name, e.g. Bob, return a greeting of the form, hello, Bob, exclamation mark. So here we have Bob, we get hello, Bob, exclamation mark. Alice, hello, Alice, exclamation mark. Hello, X, exclamation mark. So all we have to do here is leverage our understanding of what's called concatenation. Concatenation is the process of adding strings. And in most programming languages, you can add strings simply by doing this. Return, and I can put string 1 plus string two. And notice if I hit go, I'll get them all wrong, but I get string one, string two. What's really important here to highlight where students typically make a mistake here is they forget about spaces. Spaces count as a character inside of a string. So if I want a space between string one and string two, I have to actually put that in there. I can put it in either here or I can put it in there, but it has to be included. So if this problem is asking you to return, if I look, we always see the problem always starts with the word hello. So I'm going to put hello, and then a space, and I need to put that space there. Now I'm going to say plus the name, which is the variable, and then plus and the exclamation mark at the end. And that's it. So a pretty simple problem, but this is kind of an essential idea that, that you use all over the place across many languages. I hope this helped. Have a wonderful day.